Hey guys, Wong Sel here. Today I'm playing EU4 and I'm playing as Lithuania. So this uh, country was suggested by one of my subscribers and I'm just going to go ahead and play them. Uh, I did play a Lithuania game just before this. It was terrible. Somehow or rather we supported, uh, somehow or rather we managed to get into a war with Poland. Can you believe it? Lithuania being in, at war with Poland. I have not seen that happen ever in any of the EU4 games I've played. Not that I played many, but still. If you are uh, yeah. Let's play. So this time, let's not make the mistake of supporting independence again. Let's let's not be involved in a war with Denmark. Leave them alone. They'll be our uh, enemies, but sure. I think we can still choose them. No, we can't. Yes, we can. I can actually choose Poland. Hmm, okay. No, I'm going to choose Novgorod. Uh, I'll probably choose the Teutonic Order. Yes. And I will choose the Golden Horde. Yeah, let's choose one, one of each. One Orthodox, one Western, and one Muslim. Convert Provinces. Yes, let's do that. Mission selected. Form Alliance. Yeah, let's get this alliance going. I think we can get alliance with you also. We'll send alliances out. Uh, never mind. We'll, we'll leave it. It might be a, a mission that we can take for free. National tax modifier. Yes. Diplomatic reputation. Yes. 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 No. Spy offense. Of course, we'll be fabricating claims. This one. Yes. Uh, buy units. Yes. Three. Uh, I'll do the same thing I did just now, and I forgot to bring down army maintenance. Please give us a good leader. Oh, okay, that's a pretty good leader. Okay, uh, play at speed five. I shouldn't be playing at speed five, honestly. Never mind. Crush the Livonian order. Livonian order does not exist. Uh, does this give us? Yeah, let's get this one first, lah. I wonder if that gives us gives us claims on them. Uh, in the meantime, I'll improve relations with Bohemia. Okay. Mm, dynastic royal marriage. Can he force us to be in a personal room with him? Do we still get crushed in Livonian order? Yeah, we do. Holy crap, okay. They're getting annexed right away. They are like Rika and Teutonic Order, which means I want to get fabricate claims on Teutonic Order as well. Because we are the war leader, it's probable no. Yeah, it's very probable that Nah. You're gonna have so much So much problems though. Yeah, allied with Riga. I can get Riga for myself. Huh? I want Riga for myself. And it's Catholic. Bohemia will probably want to be my ally. We'll get as many allies as we can manage. Okay, good. You have problems there already. That's bad. Oh, we can even get alliance with Pomerania. Okay. That's the last. No, that's the third one. Okay, who else is in a disputed succession? Any of these guys willing to Ryazan? No, Ryazan is not the right religion. Austria, Hungary. Hmm. Scully, we can get a. Uh... <laughs> yeah. I might break my alliance with Pomerania in favor of Austria and Hungary. Those are really good allies. No. Okay. 
I'll leave Hungary alone for now. Actually, I shouldn't, right? Yeah. Huh? Okay, I need a legal air. If I do... Yeah, we need an air. Okay, we're at 15. Okay, let's dissolve. I don't need uh, alliance with you. Let's break this off. Okay. Let's offer our alliance with you. Why are you at war with? Why not? 27. Okay. Basically, all our... I thought Hungary was in this list. Okay, now we got to bring this up. You are at war, right? Denmark, Holsey, Norway, Poland. What war? Oh, Swedish war for independence. Oh, Poland's ready in this war. Muscovy has declared us their rival. Okay. We'll go to war with the Livonian Order, but I think they are also in this war. No, they are not. Riga and the Teutonic Order. Teutonic Order probably won't be called in there. Uh, regardless, we can probably win them on our own. Like, this amount of units. Yeah, I don't think we have a problem. Yes, we need the money. And yes, it's a sin. I'm going to go for people influence for now. Riga and the Teutonic Order. Livonian Order, Teutonic Order, and the Hansa. Uh, fine, I'll fabricate a claim on you. Ostprusen. Okay. Let's declare this war. Colin Riga. Bohemia, Poland. Take Wenden. Okay. We have our leader. Our glorious leader. Actually, no. The leader should be here. Okay. Correct. You're going to Riga. I'm going to Riga. Will you reach in time? Bye bye. And they are gone. And just like that, we can siege everything. Except we have no navy, so we can't siege that last little province up there. Austria also has no navy. Get out of here. No need to take useless attrition. Let's keep fabricate oh, we are already fabricating claims. Uh let's improve relations with Poland then. We have oh Hansa is Hansa for calling. Okay. Memo. Ah yeah, then why I fabricate a claim? For what? Oh, oh, I was fabricating a claim on Ospruzen, not Memo. Okay. Teutonic Order, yeah. Teutonic Order, you are mine. Soon. Hmm.
Getting Kerlang will also allow us to fabricate a claim on Danzig. Now the question here is, do I want to... Do I want to annex them completely? I'm not sure. Hmm. It's a very tempting. Suppress. Uh, I'll negotiate. Oh, don't tell me they're going for Danzig, man. Oh, shit, they are. Glimber. That means we have to go for Danzig. Uh, I want Danzig, but I suppose if it's going to be Pomeranius, it, uh, yeah, what can you do about it, right? You just get the rest, lor. It'll be us if it, it'll be ours eventually. How long will this take, brother? I'm sieging all your shit ready, you know. You give me 21% forever. <laughs> Come on, just... Ah, finally. You guys done. I want to regal for myself. Money. Wonderful. Uh, get out of here. Why the, did it cost us? I have a claim on it. I have a fucking claim on it. 94. Fine. Have to wait until that hits hundred percent. Fabricate claim for Armlan. That's probably the only thing we can get. Later they get some powerful allies, uh, then we are a bit screwed. So I'll declare this war for Memo. No one will get called in, Mecklenburg, fine. Eating too much at once is a recipe for disaster. But I think we time this... If we time this well, we can go in our favour. We got, just gotta make sure we siege Danzig. I don't mind if we don't get Neumark, but we want to siege Danzig to prevent Pomerania from getting it. And also, uh, yeah, Novgorod is going to be in a coalition. We let's try to get Muscovy out of this coalition, or as give them as little reasons as po as possible to hate us. We should have fabricated something on Novgorod, the Bonian Order. You know, we can also declare a war. Trade superiority. Call. What's our war exhaustion? Eh? We might have. Oh, we don't need to buy it down. But does Muscovy have a claim? No, Muscovy doesn't even have a claim there. Then what are they going to war for? The game plays a. Muscovy games they play a little weird. Memo. Done. Not there. Marienburg. Done. Uh.
Full annexation, that's 64%. Will cost zero diplomatic power. Okay, they are crushed. And getting that many uh getting that many Catholic states uh, I think it has pushed up our uh what do you call that? Our religious unity. So that helps in our revolt risk. Uh, I'll probably end this episode when we when we get the Teutonic Order out of this war, but I might have to wait a couple of years, you know, keep them at war so we don't we don't get that much uh, overextension. I have to fabricate a claim on two states. We'll get two states from North Rod as well, if we can manage it. Okay. Can go to war for Poland, but I'll fabricate a claim here first. Ingaman Lan, yes. And let's improve relations with Hungary. It's going to be a quite a while. I wonder if we can get Danzig. What's Danzig? Danzig. I can release Dan. Okay, I see. I can get that. I can release Danzig, make Danzig into my vassal, then use Danzig to go inside, go this way. But Danzig is only one state, mate. It's just, yeah, it's just this one state. Is is it even worth releasing? I can't. I can't. I can't do this. Sorry, bro. I cannot. I cannot release you right now. I release you right now, I'll be in trouble. Go to war for Kong. Declare war, take Kong. Yeah, you can get another military leader. Useful. Provinces should just should be enough already, and we we'll wait for all these stuff to call before we take stuff from. Huh? You piece them out? Okay. I see. At least we wait until we call for peace, huh? Uh, we can get the next tech level for nah. Talk about it. We got done. 81% for the rest. Dun, 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 dun. Can we make Lithuanian? Lithu no, you can't. This would be 68. Can you? No, this is yeah. We can only take this in one go, but we have to get this court first. Good. Now we can piece you out. Uh, what's our overextension at? Need to check. Uh, our overextension is at twenty percent. So is this gonna bring? It's sixty-eight. So it's lower than that. Give me money. And give me war operations. No, oh, it's already our call. What the hell am I doing? I'm calling everything else, right? Okay, good. Huh <sighs> wow, this is really aggressively expanding, uh. hmm. 
Holden still likes us. We can probably go to war with Crimea next if they're not allied with the Ottomans. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, fabricate a claim on Mansur. Actually, no, we should be fabricating claims on Golden Horde. Golden Horde is not allied with the Ottomans? Yeah, they are not. Ryazan is not allied with anyone. Ooh, we could take Ryazan. Before Muscovy takes them. Which they will. Denmark, just if it's just Denmark, it's fine. Denmark don't really bother me. Okay. Okay. Sure. I'll take it. I'll just take two states from you. Which leader has a siege value? Uh? You. Go over there then. Ooh, snap. Finland got released. And is Finland orthodox? Indeed it is. North Roy into my vessel now, not yet, so no, we can't. Uh, I'll just wait for this to finish coring because we are at 88%. I think this would try bring us over the edge 20%. Yeah, we've got to wait for that to finish coring first. In the meantime, uh, yeah, fabricate claims on you, Ryzen on this as well. And you're not allied with anyone, so I should go to war with you also, before anything bad happens. Yep. Before you ally with someone else. Basically blitzing them, uh. Now I can piece you out. This would be treaties. Give me money. Cede these two provinces. Fine. Got quite a bit of unrest there. Reduce. Okay. They're just us. I'm just expanding like mad. This is crazy. I'm going to get everyone angry with us now. Oh, what did I just press? I just press two buttons in quick su succession. A lot of people hate us. If they hate us, it's better to go to war with them before they join the coalition, right? <laughs> uh, very weird reasoning. And even after all this was our manpower is still doing very well. Where did that come from? Nah, just stay there. Lah. We can go to war if you lose back. Take two or three states. 
What's our overextension at? 88. So Tula is how much? Uh? Gotta wait for a diplomat to come come back. Have you seen Lithuania get this big so quickly? I haven't seen that before. Uh, who is our uh, enemy? Uh? We haven't chosen one. Uh, I'll issue an embargo against you. Oh, that only brings us up there. stuff to get caught before I can take Tula. Boost stability. How long more? 0 0.6 years. I got a harsh treatment then. Take lip test. Cannot afford that lah. 0 0.6 years. I, I, I'll I wait. Uh, I'll wait until it's like 95%. Ryazan. Okay. Okay. So that cost me quite a bit. I think we have to be at peace. Any more will start. We'll have huge rebellion problems. Now I can get this. And in fact, change religion, four operations. I don't need to be my vassal. Okay. Look at Lithuania. Everyone hates us now. Hmm. Probably I'm gonna choose Muscovy. Then I'm gonna embargo them right away. Knowledge is power, ignorance is bliss. Yep, indeed, ignorance is bliss. We have 48, we have Eclipse, some people, and we need to start building ships. Eight ships, and we'll probably use them as privateers against Muscovy. Uh, so that we can have some more of those nice power projection points. Uh, nine ships. Uh, yeah, our, mili our war exhaustion, it'll take some time. Like. 10 years, okay, 10 years, acceptable. Uh, overextension is reducing. After this two is done, it's, it's, it'll only be 12%. So that'll be done. Uh, I'm actually, actually right now, what I really want to do is to click here national focus plus two but now nah, we'll leave it at, we'll leave it at that for now uh poland is our i'm not too sure if we'll be forced into a junior to, as a player i'm not too sure if lithuania can be forced to be, become a junior partner in a in a war but now um let me build the unit but we'll we just we just have to see see what happens uh like if it does happen it happens right we can always declare war to declare independence and i think we're strong enough to take on poland we we just ate up this whole chunk here and bit bit sized bit pieces up here and here it should be easy i didn't know lithuania was so strong <laughs> i must have <laughs> the, the earlier game I, I played it terribly but okay yeah lithuania is very very strong Disputed succession, Austria and Poland. It can still happen. Are we saying air? No. If your air dies, then maybe we can. You. Same dynasty. Yeah. If your air dies, which is which is a high chance of happening, considering he's forty five years old. How is your air older than that? 
Oh, is this? No, no, no. Oh, if the king dies, we become the ah, we become we rule in Poland as well. Cool, 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 cool. Ah, I want to play this game, but it's late. I have to stop it. It's so fun. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed it too. I'm gonna to end the episode here. Uh, in the next episode, you'll probably see us prob uh, vassalizing the Teutonic Order. Or maybe just taking them outright. Taking them outright of it would be a bad move la, because it's going to give us... It's going to cause us coalition problems up here. But in the Art of War coalition, coalitions are not that terrible as it was previously. So I'm not too worried. Uh, we can go... You'll probably see us going to War of the Golden Horde for three states. But we might wait a little while for our war exhaustion to die down first so that would probably be it every year is uh one so five years we we'll probably wait three year 3.5 years 3.4 years for that to be done with uh we can't we can go to war of crimea and we should go to war of crimea before they get in alliance with the ottomans so that's another another group we might even go to war with both of them at once uh, i don't think they're strong enough to to counter us if you look at the ledger, uh, we are ninth. Ninth, okay. Three armies. Force limit. We, are, we, we, we can't compare to France, but we are up there already. We are number four. On par with Castile. Just slightly below France. So that's cool. Lithuania. Massive expansion. Uh, we have tons of diplomatic power, so we, pro we probably have to buy this down before we get the next national idea. If I were to get a national idea, uh, I might take trade or diplomatic ideas. Uh, or I might just go for full military ideas first, so that I get, in the long run, I get a more, I get greater discounts from the, from the tech. So I'm not sure whether I should do that. But we'll see when we get that idea. We'll make that decision then. Uh, for now, uh, thank you for watching. If you did enjoy the episode, please leave a like. If you want to see more, subscribe to the channel and I will see you next time.